Um, this is the story of how we got arrested and ended up in a Belgium jail. Hello, uh, welcome back. This is episode 10. I had a few people hit me up and think uh, that I couldn't count, but episode 10 is the jail episode of we go to jail. I have no Ali or Josh. Um, it's just me. This feels weird doing it by myself. This mic isn't even on. It's just here for, I feel like I need something to hold on to that sounded a little gay. Let me start off by saying, don't try this. This was a stupid idea by some stupid people that landed us in a bit of hot water. Sorry, mum and dad, if you if you're watching this, your boy's a felon. Well, not a felon, but a criminal. Smooth criminal. Let me take you back to when we were in the beautiful country of Belgium. If you're not aware, there's this massive festival that goes on every year called Tomorrowland. And it was in Belgium at the time we were in Belgium and we tried to get tickets but they were hideously expensive and they sold out within like minutes. We were like hey if we're in Belgium why don't we just still try go to the festival. Legally not legally that's up for debate. So we wake up we're like let's go to this small town called Boom outside of Antwerp. All right we're here in um some place just outside of Antwerp. Uh, we're just scouting out some good spots to try sneak into the Tomorrowland. It's just the biggest festival in the world so probably minimal security. Yeah? yeah 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 I'm sure we can just stroll in. A lot of walking ahead that's very well locked down. This will either be the best idea we've ever had or the by far the worst one. We end up in uh jail and you don't see a video in the next couple of days. <laughs> You know what happened to us. We circled the perimeter, got stopped a couple times, and they're like, what are you doing? We're just looking at the area, bro. Chill out. Which they didn't believe. They just told us to pretty much f***ing get lost, mate. Which we never take no for an answer. That sounds wrong in different circumstances. Um, f so we're like, screw it, let's just do it. So we bashed through some bushes for like an hour. We got pretty close. We were dodging security left, right and center. It was all going splendid. We got to the perimeter right in front of the main stage and we dilly-dallied. We dilly-dallied for too long, trying to debate jumping the fence or not. We waited too long and a security guard came around on his bike and he, he ratted us out. We were like, ah, shit, tough, we got caught. You know, they would just kick us out. How wrong we were. They chucked us in a paddy wagon and questioned us. That was fun. Took our fingerprints. Took our palm prints. They, was, they like got the side of the palm down there really odd. We got mug shots as well. I was trying to find the mug shots, but I could not find them online. So they took all our stuff and they drove us to Antwerp jail, uh, where they locked us up for, I think it was 15 hours in total. We didn't get fined or anything, but I honestly would have rather taken a fine. It's just a concrete room. There was one guy in there when we went in by then there was about 15 other dudes in there they all spoke french so we we couldn't understand them so we're just trying to sleep in there and you can't because it's just concrete they give you a blanket but it's too cold still um the food was just bread and cheese and you'd think it'd be good cheese because you're in belgium no they held us until the festival finished we ended up getting out at like 5 a.m and they just dropped us back to the festival and we took the car and drove it to amsterdam which was like a two-hour drive i think that's when josh and elliot got fined like 150 euros each for sleeping in the car it wasn't the most pleasant isn't of, of nights the jail system definitely works i don't want to commit any crimes like 15 hours in there was bad imagine spending like years in there look at me bro do i look cut out for a prison i'm the first guy getting butt in the prison man but hey you learn your lesson when in rome right just outside tomorrowland we uh may or may not have tried to sneak in and we got arrested not a, not a good night <laughs> if i had to rate the uh the quality of accommodation uh there was no mattresses we had one shitty ass blanket and we're in a room with 15 other c**ts who just speak f***ing French and uh, everyone was f***ing ripping ass all night and it was basically just a hot box of f***ing fecal matter if you ask me. But the vibes were immaculate. That's all that matters. And we're out now. We're walking to the car. 